What's up guys and welcome back to Auto Wisdom. When we think of high performance turbocharged four cylinder engines, oftentimes we think of engines such as the K20C1 that's featured in the Honda Civic Type R, the Subaru EJ25 that was featured in the WRX STI for over 20 years, the legendary 4G63 that was in the Mitsubishi Lancer Evolution with its insane power figures and aftermarket potential. But what if I told you that there is a German turbocharged four-cylinder power plant that is being mass produced today that is not only reliable it is durable it is strong it makes decent power and it has a ton of aftermarket potential and that is the BMW B48. The B48 was first developed in 2014 with the introduction of its implementation into the F56 generation of Mini Cooper Club vehicles. Following that into the next year, 2015, the engine was then implemented into the first BMW production models, such as the 230i, as well as the 330 and 430i. The B48 is part of BMW's B58 family, except it lobs off two cylinders, and it is two liters in displacement. It is a twin scroll turbocharged, direct injected, inline four cylinder engine that features variable valve timing, variable valve lift, and a closed deck design. This engine also has air to water intercooling, which provides a great deal of efficiency to the motor itself. The cylinder head and block are both made of aluminum. And while this is a force induction engine, it is a relatively lightweight platform that enables great handling in any of the vehicles that it's implemented into. In 2018, BMW revised the B48 with a TU or technical update, which featured a few notable improvements such as a one-piece timing chain as opposed to the uh, earlier two-part unit, separate cooling circuits now for the cylinder head and the crankcase, and the forged crankshaft in the engine now being only two pounds in overall weight due to the use of lighter materials and a different machining method. The fuel system was also upgraded with a Bosch HDP6 high pressure fuel pump and Bosch HDE V6 injectors that were borrowed straight from the P48 turbocharged motorsport engine that's used in BMW's DTM race cars. Following that technical update in 2018, BMW introduced an even more high performance focused version of the B48 engine in the year 2019, which was featured in cars such as the F56 chassis, Mini John Cooper Works GP, the BMW M235i Grand Coupe, as well as the X2 M35i. And this variant featured an even stronger crankshaft with larger main bearings, forged pistons, a lower 9.5 to 1 compression ratio, which allowed BMW to turn up the boost in the engine from a larger turbocharger and that compressed air was blown through a reworked intake tract. Now all those upgrades were good for around 302 horsepower at 5,000 RPM and roughly 332 pound-feet of torque as early on as 1,750 RPM which allows for a great deal of torque early on in the rev range as the engine will also rev up to a meaty 7,000 RPM redline. Overall reliability of the B48 has proven to be relatively solid due to the car's overbuilt construction with its closed deck design, with its air to water intercooling and its forged bottom end. And in addition to that, the engine is relatively underrated from the factory and has a lot of potential that has been proven time after time by many enthusiasts. A simple off the shelf, Remap of the ECU can yield relatively large power gains anywhere between 20 to 30 wheel horsepower and 30 to 40 wheel torque. And then if you throw things like ethanol into the mix, throw in a catalyst downpipe with a freer flowing exhaust system and a larger turbocharger, these engines are capable of well over 400 wheel horsepower, touching even 500 horsepower to the crank in many instances. And what's even more impressive is the fact that it is done reliably, and you can also pair this in a platform of your choosing, such as with a rear wheel drive application, a front wheel drive application, or even even an all-wheel drive application as well. These cars can also be purchased in the BMWs or Minis with manual transmissions or the iconic ZF8 gearbox that has proven to be quite fast and is a great transmission both on and off the track. And overall, the B48 is proving to become a tuner's delight. 
In fact, this engine is so popular now that there are certain enthusiasts and shops that are swapping B48 engines into E46 race cars and taking them out on the track to compete in sanctioned racing events, which I personally believe serves as a large testament to their durability both on and off the track, as well as to their strength when it comes to throwing extra power at these motors. Pair in the fact that this is a relatively lightweight four-cylinder engine with its aluminum design and construction, and you have a platform that not only handles well, but also adds a significant amount of performance to any vehicle that it is featured or included with. I think the long-term outlook for the B48 engines is very, very positive as BMW not only continues to improve the engine design, but incorporate it in more and more of their models and continue to produce it while at the same time meeting stringent emissions regulations. And that's great news for enthusiasts because it means that the overall outlook of these engines, their parts and general running costs, general servicing is going to be very accessible, easy, and relatively inexpensive for the most part. So the B48 overall is a huge win for enthusiasts across the board that appreciate internal combustion engines that are looking for something affordable or an entry level platform to get their hands into, not only for the sake of tuning or tampering with the vehicle in terms of its power and modification potential, but also if they wanna track something as well, the B48 has already proven that it can be put up to any task. If you did enjoy this video, please make sure to leave a thumbs up as well as subscribe Subscribe down below to the channel if you are new here. With all that being said, I will catch you all in the next one. Take it easy, my friends. Bye-bye.